are doing a video. Now, if you guys didn't know, my mom has three children. I will give you guys a few seconds to go ahead and guess who, which one I think I am, the oldest, the middle, or the youngest. Pause it and put it down in the comments below. Okay, I'm guessing you guys guessed by now. If you guess youngest, you are correct. I'm the youngest out of three. My brother's 21, my si sister is 17, and I am 13. So anyway, we're doing a video about how being the youngest is not really the best thing because a lot of reasons. People always think that being the youngest is the best because you get spoiled and stuff, but not in my case. Mm -hmm. Okay, anyway, first thing, I was thinking about this. I inevitably, 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 I think that's what it is. My parents spend less of their life with me than they do my sister and my brother. What I'm saying here is, my brother's 21, my sister's 17. So they have spent most of my parents' life my, they've been in my parents' life more than I have for a longer period of time. And when they died, they would have had spent more time with them than I would have. Which is very morbid, but I thought about that and it's really weird. Okay. Second thing is, I... What was I going to say? Hand-me-downs. I constantly get hand-me-downs. Like the seventh grade dress I wore on my sister eighth, my sister's eighth grade dress like I don't know I constantly get hand-me-downs half the stuff I wear is hand-me-downs so it sucks third thing is graduation around graduation time my sister graduated from middle school as my brother was graduating from high school now, the same thing will happen for me. As I'm graduating middle school, my sister will be graduating high school. So, in fact, they will be getting her prom picture, her prom, her prom stuff, her graduation stuff, her senior pictures, her senior, senior ring, all that type of stuff. And I think that's like, and then I'm just over here like, I mean, I don't know where. Number four, you never get to do anything because you are the youngest, so I guess you're protected, so you can't ever go out and do something. Number five, I do chores in my family. When I was little, we always did all the kitchen together and all the living room together, but when my brother got a job, me and my sister took turns doing the kitchen and the living room when I was about seven, and then... When my sister gets a job, I will be doing everything by myself. The living room, the kitchen, the walkway, everything like that, I will be doing by myself. So basically, I will be cleaning the whole house every single day. Sorry about the background, by the way. Fifth, I always get the last choice. Saying, in my family, me and my sister... On Christmas we both got a TV because at the time we shared a room well we ended up moving we still hadn't opened it like I was saying it was still not opened like it out of the box the TV was not out of the box so we said when we moved we were each gonna get our own room because my brother was not gonna live with us that one of us got the big bed, which is my brother's old bed, and one of us got the big TV. My sister, since she was the oldest, got the first choice. She got to choose if she wanted the big bed or if she wanted the big TV. I thought I wanted that bed so badly because it's so comfortable. I thought she would have picked the TV at the time. She picked the bed. So she got the little box TV, and I got the big TV but I got the little bed she got the big bed you get it you think I got the good half of the bargain 
But when we bought the house we got, there were two rooms upstairs right next to each other. We get to choose, oh yeah, like I'm saying, sorry, interruptions. When we moved in, there was two rooms. We both got to choose which one we wanted. And, of course, my sister was older, so she got to choose which one she wanted first. Out of instinct, she chose the one with the actual door and was bigger. So, like, right now, she has this big luxury room with an actual door and has a small little box with a small little door. It's not an actual door. Okay. My door, you know how those um, doors have like a handle that you turn? No, you just slide mine. This is the second time now that it's been broken. So basically all I have is this. Also, when we moved in, since I got the big TV, I got the little nightstand to put my TV on, but the bottoms came out so I can't put anything in there to begin with. And my sister got the actual drawer. so. I went weeks without a drawer until I got this little plastic one from Walmart. So, as you can see, I didn't get the good side of the bargain at all. So, yeah, that's why youngest always complain about being the youngest because of all those reasons and more. It sucks. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all. Peace. Until next time, peace out, Girl Scouts.